We're leaving Whistler and heading to Kelowna. We're meeting up with some friends. Yeah, hey, hey. You can open up to me. Show me what's inside. So we just pulled over at Arrow Leaf Winery and it's a pretty nice spot. It's got a really beautiful view of the Okanagan Lake. And we're gonna try out some wines here. Cam, do you know what they specialize in here? Uh, they special in um, grape. Grape, grape wines? wine? Grape wines, yeah. Hi, Benji. Pretty good. And Benji and Luna are joining us. So you're gonna wait outside maybe. We don't know yet, we'll find out. Away, you're my little flower. Blooming in the night. Only for This place looks pretty new. Did it just open? I think it opened like six or seven years ago. Okay. Yeah. Are you from Kelowna? I am from Kelowna. I grew up in Lake Country and we didn't used to have all these wineries. So now that we do, it's so busy and it used to be like the quietest part of town. So the locals were very upset when it became Lake Country and not Winfield. Howdy. Hi. How are you? Good. You gonna taste some wines? Yeah. <laughs> what kind of wine do you like? The red stuff. I like the dark, the dark wine. Like a uh, Cab Sav. Uh, it doesn't really matter, just as long as it's dark. Oh, you should definitely have some dark wine here. <laughs> the most grown red grape in Austria. So, our, our Pinot Gris. so we just finished an amazing tasting here at Aeroli. Uh, I'm gonna grab a bottle of the Bacchus. It's really, really good. One thing to note when you come to Cologne and you're trying some of their red wines, they're not gonna be as deep and full body as you would get down south in California. They are still like really nice, but it's more of a lighter, summery red wine. Um, their Pinot Noirs are great, but they are on the lighter side. These are great, so I'm gonna grab a bottle of this. All right, we're trying here some pastry from Arrowleaf, and it looks good. It's it looks pretty. delicious. Is, it's it, does it taste as good as it looks? It tastes better. It tastes better. Highly recommend. Does it taste like lavender? Like Look at the flowers on this. Interesting fact, you can eat the flower. Eat it. No, you cannot. Yeah. He did it. It's a pansy, right? You're a pansy. A pansy for a pansy. <laughs> you saw it first here, people. <laughs> Hamster eating flowers at Arrowleaf. I know. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Oh my god, you can really taste the grapes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bacchus, you did it again. <laughs> so what is the name of this place, guys? Ex Nihilo. This is Cam's Wine Tours here. We are in East Side, Kelowna. We are here to taste some wines. Follow me. You were easy. Spend some time. Why, hello there. How's the wine tasting going so far? Delicious. So, uh, quite nice. It's really cute with great views here in wine country. I wish I were simple that I gave. We're just here at Ex Nilo. We just finished a tasting. I really enjoyed the Chaos Vampata. Super, super delicious. We're gonna take a bottle home to enjoy with us another day. Um, but I also really like the name. I don't know if they intentionally thought about this, but what do you think of when you think of this He likes vampires. Vampire Diaries is his favorite show. He likes Damon Salvatore. Okay, Megan, stop. And also how we're paying for our accommodation is we're buying wine whenever we go places so that people don't kick us out off the couch. Yeah, we're staying in some free accommodation so when you show up with wine, you're good to go. So the Vampata wine that I purchased, the grapes are actually grown right here on the property and they smell absolutely amazing. What do they smell like? Mm, it's very aromatic, very lovely. Thank you. Yep. So, first time Frequency Wines, what are you guys' thoughts so far? Cam, what do you think? I think it's amazing. It's really cool. It's the first place I've ever seen they, what's it called? Clarify their wine with sound, sound frequency. Sound frequency. Really neat. Hmm. That 
that's really cool. I just, and it's such a cool thing. This is definitely the funkiest wine I've ever made. Mm -hmm. And look at this packaging. This is wine in a can. And the parents of the son who owns this winery own another winery up the street called Vibrant Wines. Let's turn the house. We're getting wild in here. <laughs> Stick to engineering cams. Here, I'll show you what's up. I'm actually good. Vibrant Wines, it's actually the father of the son of Frequency Wines. We're gonna stop here for a tasting. I don't know, it's gonna get pretty crazy, we'll see. Follow me. So as I mentioned, we just walked into Vibrant Wines. It's the only 3D winery in the entire world that they're aware of, that I'm aware of. And all the art in here, all the clothing, all the bottles, everything is 3D. Absolutely amazing. I don't know what's gonna happen after I drink a bottle or two. It's gonna get nuts. Yeah, we'll need the glass. Take them off. Thank you. Wow. Cool. So it's just the two of you tasting? Three. three. Oh, well, three? Sure. Oh, I know. Do we all have a third? Oh, yeah, sorry. There yeah, you are. Lovely. All right, so I'm Morella. I'll be your uh, tasting host today. Welcome to the Vibrant Vine. Have you been before? No. No. Oh, best time it is. Alrighty, Serge, the Pinot Panda um, reference before. We have more like a deck or a, uh, a backyard or a porch. So we just pulled over at Summer Hill Pyramid Winery and don't really know anything about it. It's in the Mission area of Kelowna and it's got a great view. You can definitely see that. We'll go taste some wines and let you know how it goes. So it looks like that's where they brew the wine in that pyramid right there. I don't know what it does to the wine, but I'm sure we're gonna find out. So we're at the Summer Hill Pyramid Winery, and we're doing lots of wine tours while we're here in Kelowna. And this one is really good, but it's also really busy. I think one of the reasons is because they give free wine tastings. So it's super busy in here. The wine is good. We did get ourselves a little bottle, um, and it has really nice views. The red wine in particular I thought was really good. We tried mostly reds. So the red wine here in Kelowna is actually not their strong suit. They really are good at the white wine. So we've been buying more white wine, but we did go for a bottle of red today. It all depends on your taste. Everyone's got a different flavor profile. So we're just at Tantalus Winery doing a tasting. Uh, it's a pretty nice place. The view is absolutely amazing. And I really like the way that they finish the inside. It's really, really beautiful. Uh, I don't know what kind of wines they have here, but someone did recommend it, so should be good. We're excited. Complimentary pour. This is our Bear Chardonnay, done with our youngest Chardonnay vines on the property. Yeah. The perfect way to end our road trip with some wine, and we're gonna get some Riesling and Pinot Gris. And what else is the red? Yeah, my back was a little bit sore after driving for five and a half hours. So I saw a winery sign and I was like, okay, I think it's time for a and winery. And it's kind of rainy, so we were like, oh, let's find something to do. I think the crazy thing is, is we have to go set up a tent now <laughs> in the rain. I know. I just want to hail tonight. I know your aunt will actually be very nice to us if we show up with wine. Yes, you're right. She's a wine drinker. You're correct. I don't know if she drinks red or white. I don't know either. Megan will never order a Chardonnay. But you did like that like Chardonnay, it. didn't you? It's unoaked. As long as it's unoaked, I can do it. But I don't like oaked wine. So to be honest, I actually wasn't a huge fan of BC wines, really. Yeah. Like, we've been yeah. drinking California wines for a long time. Like, in the liquor store, I'll never buy a BC wine. Yeah. yeah. But dude, that's because we went to... California and we went to wineries and that's where But now that I've been now that I've been at my first Kelowna winery I'm changing my tune here. Yeah. Especially your whites. 
Yes, the whites are very nice. They're very well balanced.